there. Chrome here. I'm outside the town of Dawnstar. My friend Inigo. He came here from uh, Langley's cabin. From uh, way over there. Uh, from there we learned, of course, about uh, Inigo's uh, prophecy. And him being a champion who will save uh, Skyrim and the land from uh, this thing called the Doomstrider. So, uh, well, not entirely sure about that entire thing, but, uh, well, whatever happens to Inigo, we will be at his side. Prices. We will assist him, just as he assists us in our adventures as the Dragonborn. Uh. Now we are freezing to death here. For some reason, not even this campfire here at the Khajiit camp is uh, warming us up. So what are we going to do? Well, we're going to go home. <laughs> and not home as in Breeze Home, eh? that's, a, that's a long way off uh, right over there. No, we're going to a new home that we have. And it's a home that uh, we just uh, acquired quite recently actually. But we only found out now that we have it. Here it is. Yes, I know I'm busy to death. Here. The Dweba Storage Cube. Let's go inside, huh? 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 Look at that! Welcome to my new home! Ha ha ha! We have to uh, bring in Ego here, of course. Good thing we have the Summon in Ego spell. Come here, Ego! Finally! Where have you been, my friend? Uh, we are here inside the storage cube. I am here for you. Alright, eh. Uh, I am all ears. Yes. Take five, Minigo. You've earned it. Thank you. Your hospitality is humbling. Alright. So Inigo is our first uh, follower, companion to, to be welcomed here. Well, he's also our first time here as well, a bit, eh? Now, if you'll recall, we actually acquired the storage cube quite some time ago. It was during our adventure into the Sightless Pit. We picked it up uh, while we were looting the place. We thought it was just a little trinket. Yeah, uh, it was this. Is stress relieving. Yes. <laughs> yes, I thought it was just another lexicon kind of thing. It's turned out it's uh, much more. It's a portable home. We are actually inside the cube. Oh well, uh, well, actually, it might not be. According to Langley, uh, the cube itself is probably just a way of transporting ourselves here. This place is a party, or uh, in his own words, is like a pocket place. It's a, it's its own space. It's not in Tamriel or Skyrim. It's not anywhere. It's everywhere, but nowhere. It's always here. If uh, that makes sense. <laughs> it doesn't! Uh, it's, uh, but, but, well, I really don't care how it works. The thing is, all I need to do is take out the cube. And we're here! Stay, uh, safe, warm, snug, and cozy. And, uh, well, this is, uh, it's obviously made for just one or two people, but uh, we're going to set it up so we can uh, have some... Uh... Alright. We'll set up a, a bed here for an ego. Yeah, so if he wants to sleep, he can uh, sleep over there. I want to actually drink Room for a few more, uh, for a couple more followers. Alright. We can actually store all our stuff here. It's so convenient. 
All right there. Yes. Don't have to carry around this chest anymore. Uh, which is uh, kind of sad because uh, this is a bit, uh, very loyal chest. <laughs> All right. Let's take that. That. In fact, let's take everything. All right. Let's set up uh, stuff. Let's put the stool over here. All right. Put food here. Uh, there's pretty much everything here that you need uh, from a home. Uh, you can cook, uh, cook stuff here. You can store all your stuff. You can sleep. There's an enchanting table. There's an alchemy table. There's a smithy, there's an entire smithy, there's even a, a smelter. It's amazing. You can, tanning rack, smelter, a full, uh, we can craft anything here. It's so, wow. You can put your books here, enchanting. Just make yourself comfortable, Inigo. All right, eh. Uh, we need some other tenants. Ah, yeah. And often short. If you ever get the chance to relax, take it. Well, we'll be able to relax any time now since we have this place, eh? <laughs> Alright. <sighs> Let's fix it up. Yeah. Water keg. Now we can uh, replenish. Alright, now that's good. Alright. Ah, we need more bedrolls, of course. I don't care if it's an eagle, this is my home. Alright. Yeah. Now we have, uh, we have quarters for up to three. Three or four more companions. <laughs> All right. Set up a chair here. A little reading corner. All right. One more chair over here. Ah. This place is now as cozy as any home, eh? Huh? Is this where you plan your adventures? Well, you only just got this place, my friend. Anyway, you stay here for now, all right? You just chill, relax. I'll handle things for now. Now, if you want out, I can just summon you. You just tell me, eh? Huh? I'll know if you want out. Just, eh... Uh, just stay here, relax, all right? All right. And that's it. Ah. It's awesome! Really! It's magical. It's like that magical bag of that uh, famous Kajit thief. Uh, 
Oh Gott, ist der ihm. Haha, anyway. Geht da, keine Mix ist, äh, ein lot more mobile. You're not afraid to just uh, go anywhere now. When you know that you can always go home with the blink of an eye, huh? Hey, let's keep the kinder spell ready. So where are we headed? I think you're going to Dawn Star, but uh, uh, uh Well, we're already here, why not? Let's check out what's going on. We sold off uh, a lot of our loot uh, from the Khajiit here. They're just dreams. Please tell her, Erander. Listen to your friend. They are just dreams, my dear. Hey. I assure you that it is quite normal. It's the same dream over and over again. You think that's normal? It's evil, I tell you. Erander, she has a point. You keep telling us no harm will follow these dreams, but they must be an omen. Give him a chance to speak. He's trying to help us. Everyone, please. I'm doing what I can to end these nightmares. In the meantime, all I ask is you remain strong and put your trust in Lady Mara. I, I will. Thank you. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. Take yes. a clean mug around here somewhere. Yes, yes. Uh, hello there. Need a room? Don't worry. Nightmares don't seem to happen for travelers. Nightmares? Really? So, this whole town is having nightmares? It's not exactly normal, eh? Anyway, uh, I'm not really looking for a room. Uh, <laughs> a long story, but uh, I'm looking for work. You have any needs? Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Huh. Giant, eh? All right. All right, thank you. Thank you very much. Good day. Where's that priest? All right, I couldn't help but over here that everyone here has been having strange nightmares. What's wrong with everyone? The entire town is being plagued by horrible nightmares. They're in serious danger, but I'm afraid there's little I can do about it. Eh, yeah, what could you do anyway? Dreams are dreams. They are not real. Aren't they? These dreams are manifestations created by the Daedric Lord, Vermina. Yeah, of she course they are. She has an awful are. hunger for our memories. Uh. In return, she leaves behind nightmares. Not unlike a cough marks a serious illness. I must end her terrible influence over these people before the damage becomes permanent. All right. I'm interested. So what's your plan? I need to return to the source of the problem, to Nightcaller Temple. Perhaps you'd be willing to assist me in that regard. What do you mean, return? So you've been there before? I've already said too much. Where? If anyone overhears what we're saying, it could start a panic. Where? What panic? What do you mean? That you trust <laughs> me and help me end Dawnstar's nightmare. All right, I trust you. How can I help? Wonderful. My Lady Mara will be quite pleased. Huh. Nightcaller Temple is only a short walk from Dawnstar. Come, we must hurry. I promise to answer all of your questions. Follow me. Just keep in mind, Dunmer. If you try to double cross me. They'll never find your body. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, wait for me. Oh, this place. Where are you? Follow me. It's this way. All right. Hurry up. Good to finally have a 
chance to help these people. Helplessly watching them suffer is very difficult. Huh. It's not exactly normal. The tower on that hill is our uh. destination. People around here call it the Tower of the Dawn. I'm not familiar with the tower's history, but it was deserted for quite a long time before the night called the temple was assigned inside. When the temple was active, it would rarely be seen in dawn stuff. They preferred to live solitary. You remember our aim. I'm waiting you with a great reward for your service, Master E. Ah, whatever. All right, the right. Been abandoned for decades now. Ironic, isn't it? There's a small shrine tomorrow I established inside the tower's entry hall. I was hoping to see experience and guidance. Perhaps my prayers were answered. No reason for stumbling across Dawnstar is more than a mere coincidence. No, it's not a coincidence. It was a prophecy. Eh, uh, long story. Anyway, could we hurry it up a bit? It's not exactly the most cozy of weather, eh? Huh? I want to uh, go back inside my magical Nuema uh, house. <laughs> that is a very bloody moon, huh? A lot of people are going to die tonight. Sounds just right. <laughs> oh, my friend! You're walking like you're on a procession. I thought we were a bit on a hurry, you know. Time is of the essence. Oh, come on. Are we headed over there? I'll hurry up, alright. Ah, that guy walks like he has all the time in the world. Of trolls. <laughs> ah! All right, that's what I call fast. Oh, ah, three of you. Three trolls! Less than nothing for Chrome! And the Dunmer is still no in sight! Oh, come on. Oh, there you are! Don't worry, took care of the welcoming committee. Like a cozy place, eh? I call a temple. All right. Before we enter, I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. Well, years ago, this temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. They were being plagued by nightmares, just like the people of Dawnstar. Oh, were they successful? No. Knowing they could never defeat the Orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma, putting everyone to sleep. Huh. So why is it dangerous if they're all asleep? I'm concerned that when this place is unsealed, the Miasma will dissipate and they'll awaken. Both oh. Orcs and priests alike. Huh. So what does this Miasma do anyway? 
The miasma was created by the priests of Vermina for their rituals. It's a gas that places the affected in a deep sleep. Because the rituals would last for months or even years, huh. the miasma was designed to slow down the aging process. Whoa! So, uh, I take it this gas is dangerous, this miasma. Sadly, yes. The longer an individual is exposed to the miasma, the more the mind can become damaged. Those who've been under the effect of it for extended periods of time have been known to lose their minds entirely. In some cases, a few never awoke at all. Yeah. All right, whatever. So we kill everyone here, eh? Should have just said so. All right, let's hurry up. Once we get inside, all will become clear. Huh. All right. So this is Nightcaller Temple, eh? Not a very cheery place. <laughs> uh, little shrine of Mara here. Right. Come on. Let's not waste time. Give me just a moment, and I'll have this open. Whoa! Hey, that's a pretty neat trick! Can you teach me that? <laughs> what, what? Whoa, what's that? Some sort of stealth? Of corruption. The source of Dawnstar's woe. We must reach the inner sanctum and destroy it. Come, there's no time to lose. Alright. Yeah, it's bright enough. Oop. this barrier when the miasma was released. Well, that looks uh, pretty difficult to breach, huh? Eh? Impossible, actually. Huh? Hmm. I wonder... Let's go home, then. There may be a way to bypass <laughs> the barrier, but I must check their library and confirm it can be done. Ah. You know, you seem to know an awful lot about this place, eh? Care to tell me some things, eh? I suppose there's no point in concealing the truth any longer. Oh. My knowledge of this temple comes from personal experience. Ha. I was a priest of Vermina. Oh. oh well. You know, you should have told me the truth uh, earlier on, you know. Yes, you're right. I should have. But I didn't know what to say. The orcs raided the temple. I fled. I left my brothers and sisters behind to die. I've spent the last few decades living in regret and seeking redemption for Mara. And by her benevolence, I will right my wrongs. You have a big chip on your shoulder, my friend. But you seem to be sincere about wanting to change and, uh, well, you've already changed. But you're here now to write what, uh, whatever wrongs you did in the past. And I'm all for that. All right, I'm ready. I still have my key to the library. Whenever you're ready, let's move on. I'm ready now, come on. The skull needs to be destroyed as soon as possible. On. Eh. Weird. It's 
just appear. We're certain to find more of the Awakened within. Yes, I'm counting on that. Come on. Hey. Why are these guys uh, turning into ash? That's kind of odd. Maybe they already died because of that miasma, eh? So why are they waking up? Maybe some sort of weird unlife? Maybe we are just uh, letting them uh, go to their final rest by killing them, huh? I hope the tome we need is still intact. Tome? So there's a book here. Is this flame glow lost or move? Alright. Yes, yes, die. Die. Barring any more interruptions. Perhaps we can locate the information I need. <laughs> You're a pretty cool customer, Dunmer. Alright, what am I looking for? We're looking for a book of alchemical recipes called the Dream Stride. The tome bears the, the leaves of their mina on the cover. It should be here somewhere. Alright. If you'll check the shelves around the balcony, I'll check around the lower level. All right. Yeah, you didn't turn into ash, but you did. Very weird. Very weird. All right, we're looking for a book. Lots of books, but no cookies. <laughs> the firmament. Well, I'll just take any uh, still intact books. Need to build up a library over at the cube. Eh? So we can have stuff for Inigo and uh, other of my followers to read. While they're waiting around for action. Ah, there is the Dream Stride. Diabolical recipes of alchemical concoctions. <laughs> Dream Stride, mysterious alchemists of Vermina. For over a thousand years, the priests of Vermina have been masters of the art of alchemy. The complexity and potency of their mixtures are nothing short of legendary. These alchemical treasures are so highly sought after. As a single draught showing up on the black market can command sums, tens and thousands of septims. Oh, really? Of the numerous potions that have surfaced to date, Femina's torpor is perhaps the most impressive. A single sip of this viscous liquid places the imbiber in a state known as the Dream Stride. This condition allows the subject to experience the dreams of another as if they were actually there. The subject becomes an integral part of the dream. Behaving as if they belong. To any other entities in the dream state, the subject will be mistaken for the dreamer. A subject will even find his mannerisms, speech patterns, and knowledge expanded appropriately. Oh, so you take the persona. To an observer, after the subject has imbibed the potion, they will appear to vanish. As the subject traverses distances within the dream, they will also be traversing distances in the actual world. When the torpor's effect has expired, the subject will fade back into reality at exact location projected within the dream stride. Some dream strides have transported their subjects a few feet. Some have appeared thousands of miles from their origin in a matter of minutes. Whoa! It should be noted that the dream stride is highly dangerous and presents the subject with numerous pitfalls. In certain dreams, subjects have been exposed to life threatening scenarios. 
such as sicknesses, violence, and even death. Awesome! In most cases, the subject simply fades back to our world without harm. In some instances, the subject never reappeared and was assumed to have expired, or the subject reappeared and deceased. It's also quite possible that the subject would reappear in a precarious or hazardous location in reality, even though that location appeared safe within the dream stride. Vermeer's torpor is as mysterious and elusive as the priest that created it. It's unknown whether this unique transport mechanism is a result of the torpor itself or simply the odd machinations of Vermeer. But the potential for using the deep stride to penetrate seemingly impossible obstacles certainly outweighs its mysterious nature. How convenient that we found this! <laughs> hey! Eldor! Yes, my son. What is it I can help with? Yes, I found your sacred tome. Let me take a look. Mara be praised. There is a way past the barrier to the inner sanctum. Yes. It involves a recipe for a liquid known as Vermina's Torpor. Yes, yes, I've, uh, I've actually read it. Yes. The Torpor grants an ability the priests of Vermina called the Dream Stride. Using uh, dreams to travel distances in the real world. Yes, it's quite amazing, eh? Quite amazing, yes. Alchemy and the blessings of a divine distilled down into a ingestible liquid. Huh. Sadly, I have yet to see it function in person. So, wait. I'm going to be your test subject, eh? That's usually how this uh, goes. <laughs> uh, as a sworn priest of Mara, the elixir won't work for me. Uh, the torpor will only work for priests of Vermina, or the unaffiliated. The unaffiliated? Well, anyway. Alright, so you know where we can find this torpor? I believe there is a laboratory in the East Wing. If we proceed there, we should be able to locate a sample. All right. The laboratory adjoins the library. I'm hoping we'll find a sample of the torpor left undamaged. Ah. Ooh. There's a few more of these uh, awakened there. Uh... Ah, here they are. Ha <laughs> ha! Let's go down. Hey, you didn't turn into ash. Congratulations. I'm taking these back to the blockhouse. Okay, the cube. You stock up on wine. Show me an Inigo and other followers will be having a good time there. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> Just a little groceries. I really like the mood like this. Alright. Oh. Hey! Hey, you can both die, you know? It. Ooh. Potions are plenty in this Kiva tail. Ooh, void salts. That's very expensive. Uh, Alright. Now that they've been dealt with, we need to find the torpor. Alright, how will I know what it looks like? It should be in a small bottle, very similar to a potion. Huh. I'll begin searching up here. Alright. The torpor should be in a tall bottle with dark liquid. If you find it, bring it to me. <laughs> I think we 
have this already. Alright, we'll put this all inside the alchemical stores. Animago, King of Worms, ooh. It's that necromancer, eh? Pretty sure the champion of Zero Deal fed him his own entrails. <laughs> I wish I could find that guy. See how strong he is. Lots of ingredients, eh? Maybe I should get into alchemy. Surely be different kind of crafting. Uh, if I could master smithing, why not alchemy, you know? Uh, it would go a long way in uh, helping me make much better gear. Here we are. Vermina Stopper. It's a good year, too. <laughs> Alright. Hey, Ando. Did I loot you? Whoa! That's nice armor. It's a bit ugly, but uh, well, why not? Anything here? Yes. Yes, I did. Rando. Yes, my son. Yes, I what found. What I can help with? I found the torpor. I'm relieved you discovered a bottle intact. This place looks as though it was ransacked by the orcs. Uh. So, I've taken us this far, but you need to guard us the rest of the way. Uh. Drink. Right here, right now. Oh. Dawn Star's fate rests in that tiny bottle. Uh. The longer we wait, the more damage Vermina could be doing to those poor people. I understand your hesitation, uh. but I promise you that it works. All right. Let's continue. We still have much to do. Well, I have a lot to do because they're going to be drinking this weird concoction. All right, uh, where is it? Uh. Oh well, bottoms up. Ah! Orcs have uh. the inner uh. of the ah! We must hold. Uh. We can't allow the skull to fall into their hands. Uh. But no more than a handful of us remain, brother. Then we have no choice. The miasma must be released. In the asthma. But brother, we have no alternative. It's the will of their meaning. You have very energetic hands. You, uh. Are you prepared to serve the will of their Mina? Yes! I made my peace. I'm ready. Then it's decided. Alright! Brother Casimir, you must activate the barrier and release the miasma. Let nothing stop you. Yes, that's me, Brother Casimir, champion of Vermina. Nothing will stop me. Nothing. Nothing. Uh, having a little break. All right. Ah. Yeah. Hang in there. Fight well. Ah. Uh. Oh. Yes, fight for Vermina. Do not give up, my brothers and sisters. Oh. 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 Bobelina! Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 ha! 
Skyland. I'm Chrome. I'm Chrome. Hello. Hey. Oh. I'm here somehow. It worked. Mara be praised. You vanished after drinking the torpor and materialized on the other side. I've never seen anything quite like it. Well, it was quite remarkable. As if I was really there during the battle between the orcs and the, the priests. It's quite uh, disturbing being in someone else's shoes. How I envy you. Uh, I can only imagine the excitement of seeing history through the eyes of another. Sadly, uh, I am resigned to just reading of its wonders through my research of the skull. Well, if you want, I can tell you about it later. Anyway, we need to proceed. Indeed. My reverence for Vermina's machinations should not take precedence over our mission. Ha. My apologies. No problem. The inner sanctum lies ahead. We must reach the skull and put an end to Dawnstar's troubles. Lead on, my friend. All right. We must get to the skull and destroy it. It's this way. I think I still remember it. Sorry about that. Talk about rude awakenings, eh? <laughs> Ow! Ah! <laughs> Don't lose your head! <laughs> ah. Anything over here? Ooh, nice. I now. <laughs> Ah, uh, sorry about that. What else? Hey there! Hey! Don't bother to get up. Yeah, looks like both of us know where we go, huh? Their ropes. And here, brown ropes. Don't find these every day. <laughs> um. Oh, come on. It's been costing to everything here so far. Now, a stupid lock. Pass up by rhythm! Oh. Ah, there. Oh, oh! Alright! Ah. Alright, sorry about that. Hello? Oh, she's dead. Why do all you please have fish in your pockets? There's something, uh, something about fish. Oh. Ah! <laughs> hey, no need to add insult to injury, my friend. You think uh, you'd be uh, better than that? <laughs> oh, all right, we're here finally. What? Uh, uh oh, it's uh, it's them. Yeah. Yes. You're alive. 
No thanks to you, Casimir. I no longer use that name. I'm Miranda, priest of Marvel. You, Casimir! Traitor. Whoa! I ran before the miasma took you. Well, I guess it no, makes I, sense. I was scared. <laughs> I wasn't ready. Ah, weird. Enough of your lies. Ah. I can't allow you to destroy the skull, priest of Mara. Then you leave me no choice. Who's talking? But Lady Mara... Ah, sorry about that. Is it Mara's will to torment me so? Well... They were trying to kill us, Irandu. They were fanatical. Well... What else can I say? And had they succeeded, Dawnstar's fate would be sealed. You have a unique way of looking at things, my friend. Uh, just being it's practical. Not. The skull must be destroyed. If you'll stand back... I'll perform the ritual granted to me by Lady Mara. First, I need an invitation to remove the barrier. Whoa. Hey, nice, eh? Rituals complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. He will! Kill him now! Kill him and claim the skull for your own! Vermina yes. commands you! Vermina commands me! No one commands Chrome, Daedric bitch! Ha! Get out of my head! Just for that! I'm taking your treasure. <laughs> What's this? Ooh. I wonder if I can cast this. Looks pretty advanced. Uh. Oh, well, I'll we'll take it. In here! Da. Hey, Rado! Hurry up! Getting hungry! Hey. Forgive me if I don't appear relieved. This temple has taken its toll on me. Ha. Huh. So uh, are you all, are you going to be all right? In time, I believe I will. Ah. Huh. I'd constructed a meager shrine tomorrow in the antechamber where we entered. My intention was to spend the rest of my years here, burying the past and praying for forgiveness. But instead. I wish to offer my services to you. Oh! If you ever wish to journey with me, I'll be here. Ah, so you want to be a new comrade, eh? I'll think about it, my friend. Uh, I was actually thinking of trying to get a new companion, though. I was thinking of a mage. But you're pretty cool, you know? Dunmer, pretty fine warriors. And you're... You're quite, uh, Quite someone to have at, uh, fighting at your side, eh? I'll consider it, my friend. Thank you. There's no need to thank me. What you did was for the people of Dawnstar. Yes. If anyone should be thanked, it should be you. Huh. I've been here for Dawnstar. I've been here about an hour. I'm already fighting for them. Don't even know me. Well, that's being a hero for you. Whatever. It's a living. 